What's good, y'all? It's your boy Ross back at again with another video. So, we're gonna check out top 20 craziest WWE ladder moments. Now, we just finished watching Money in the Bank, and there were some crazy ladder moments within uh, Money in the Bank this year. The most noticeable one was in uh, the men's match. Matt Riddle giving Seth Rollins an RKO from the top of the ladder was chef's kiss beautiful beautiful in the most horrific way he sent seth rollins to the gulags with that move so we gotta check this out appreciate all love and support on the channel road to 90k man and uh, uh let's do the damn thing <coughs> the ladder match has been a staple piece in wwe since its debut in the early 90s what the? now we have seen many incredible what? moments in the match over the was his ass cheeks out? Pause, like. I'm not even gonna replay that. The years. So in this video, I ranked 20 of the craziest spots we've ever seen in a WWE ladder match. At number 20, we have when a superstar is thrown off the top of the ladder by their opponent. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. But none have been more shocking than when Braun Strowman tossed Kevin Owens off the top of the ladder at Money in the Bank 2018. Oh my God. Yeah, that was a. Uh... Crazy moment too. Sees us look back at all those times when we've seen a wrestler perform his signature move from the ladder through a table. Mm -hmm. Undertaker giving a last ride to Edge sticks out, but the one that tops that is the time that Cena fu'd Edge through two tables yep. in the WWE title at Unforgiven 2006. That was a classic moment too. At number 18, we look at the times when a wrestler has been choke slammed off the ladder. This is usually performed by either Undertaker or Kane. Yeah. Oh my God. With the most memorable coming at SummerSlam 2008, where Edge was choked Sam through the ring all the way to hell. Yeah, that was that was the storyline. Choke slammed him to, at straight to hell. At number we've got the creative innovations wrestlers have used over mm -hmm. the years. Whether that's Shelton Benjamin running up the ladder. Can we give Shelton Be Benjamin his flowers? Dude is so athletic. He used to be like some of my favorite moments when he was in like a ladder match. He showed his athleticism. It was ridiculous. WrestleMania 21, or John Morrison running to climb the ladder, even though it hadn't been set at WrestleMania 24. Oh. But what was most impressive was Kofi Kingston using a ladder broken in two as stilts yeah. to try and reach the briefcase at WrestleMania 26. That was impressive. I want y'all to understand, that's very impressive. <laughs> that's the balance and control to be able to do that. That was very impressive when it happened. Number 16 sees us reminisce on those times when a superstar jumps to kick his opponent off the ladder. RVD and Jeff Hardy were always the kings. A very dangerous spot. Oh my God. But the most impressive has to be the time that John Morrison drop kicked Jeff Hardy from the top of the ladder on an episode of Raw. Damn. Oh my God. Nah, that is impressive. Number 15 <laughs> is the famous suplex from the ladder. Now, ordinarily, this might not sound too spectacular, but at WrestleMania 22, when you factor in that it was performed on a 57-year-old Ric Flair, oh my it is gosh. <laughs> A normal suplex can hurt. A normal superplex from the top rope can hurt. But a suplex from a top of a ladder... There's no way you can avoid the pain. Number 14, we go to submissions. We've seen countless number of submissions on the top of the ladder over the years, but perhaps none are more memorable than seeing the walls of Jericho be performed on top of the ladder, mm -hmm. with the most famous occurring at Royal Rumble 2001 against Chris Benoit. At the time, it was a sight to behold. Oh, yeah, that, that shit was brutal. Oh, my God. At number 13, <laughs> Looks we have brutal. the power bomb. Whether it was Roman Reigns <laughs> stacking up Kofi Kingston and Neville at Money in the Bank 2015, or more recently... Seth oh Rollins my God! X, not the X for Kevin. Kevin Owens is one person. He does not have a problem taking bumps. Oh my goodness. Kevin Owens outside of the ring through the ladder. The powerbomb spot is always guaranteed to get the fans out of their seat. None more so than at Money in the Bank 2011 when Sheamus... Yep, I was thinking now when I couldn't think of it exactly which year, but I was thinking this has to be in this video. From Sin Cara through a ladder on the outside of the ring. Oh my God. At number 12, we have a good old splash from the top of the ladder. Mm -hmm. Whether it was Chris Benoit's oh. headbutt, Eddie Guerrero or RVD's frog splash, or Evan Bourne shooting... Oh splash. my God, it's beautiful. It's a pleasure to see a superstar splashing off the ladder. The most famous instances have to be either oh. RVD's five-star <laughs> frog splash on Christian on an episode of Raw. Look at that. Oh my gosh. 
or Evan Bourne's shooting star press at Money in the Bank 2011. That was Number impressive 11 too. goes to the cutter off the ladder. Now this includes the Bubba Cutter, the RKO. Mm -hmm. Randy Orton. <laughs> and most famously, the twist of fate. Matt Hardy, oh, the fate. Matt Hardy did this most often, but it's mm -hmm. one of Jeff's that was truly memorable as he performed a flying twist of fate on edge. That is cool. The timing on that. Oh, at number 10, we go to rest. Oh! of the ladder ah the edge oh yeah man oh ladder as a weapon rather than a climbing oh. device some of these spots looked and sounded brutal he's not gonna go for the kendo oh, oh my kendo. god damn no more so than sammy zane's oh. body slam to kevin owens at money in the bank just makes me cringe oh, oh my god had fans chanting holy shit yeah bro Holy shit is right, bro. I remember watching it. I was like, bro. Get this nigga some medical attention. Kevin Owens just loves taking bumps. Oh, my. Now, with the ladder match, naturally comes a lot of botches. So, at number nine, we look back at some of the infamous botches in the ladder match. Yep. Definitely a lot of botches here. RVD completely missing Jeff Hardy with a spinning leg kick. Or well, how about Eddie Guerrero failing to execute a sunset flip oh! on Rey Mysterio? Thankfully, none of these superstars got terribly injured. Yeah. Oh! oh! I don't know how much of it Morrison got! Except, of course, oh, the memorable yeah. botch, which caused Joey Mercury to break his nose and gush out with blood. Now, that's a hard watch. Oh! oh! Watching that live, I knew that wasn't, like, you know, there was that, that was no blade job. I knew that his he, he was out of position. He didn't get his hands up in enough time. He legitimately ate the corner of that ladder to his face and eye. When you seen the blood instantly pour out, I was like, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh, bro. I knew right then and there. No, that was a legit injury. Oh, my God. Oh my god. Number eight sees us revisit those times when a superstar or two are pushed off the ladder and end up landing in a heap. Oh, no! Yep. <laughs> Sometimes the superstar can improvise like, like Ricochet, Ricochet yeah. but more often than not, they're not that resourceful. Whether it be through tables oh! Oh! or a ladder itself, these oh! spots are always guaranteed oh! to pop. It's just, it just looks brutal. No more so than when Shelton Benjamin crashed and burned at WrestleMania 24. Oh, no! oh my gosh. At number seven, we have perhaps one of the most famous moves executed from the top of the ladder. Yep. Jeff Hardy's Jeff, Swanton Bomb. His song, Swanton Bomb. So take your pick, which is your favorite. All of them are legendary. Number six, we have the original innovator of high flying in a ladder match, mm -hmm. Shawn Michaels. From his infamous splash at WrestleMania 10, to his moonsault at SummerSlam 95, to his incredible elbow at WrestleMania 22. Mm -hmm. Woo -hoo -hoo! <laughs> Jay, five, I was selling five, it. We have one of my favorite moves from the ladder. The sunset, the flip. sunset flip. The most memorable for a number it's of- It's very dangerous because a lot can go wrong. Your room for error is so small you have to be precise on what you're doing or you'll mess up hurt yourself and you hurt the opponent of years had to be legitimately Eddie against edge on an episode of smackdown uh -oh. Oh, my god. oh my god that was until shelton benjamin innovated it more so at wrestlemania 24 Look at that. Oh, that was cool, bro. Until that was, Andrade that was cool. Andrade took it to another level at Money in the Bank 2019. Wait a second. Oh, my God. <laughs> that spot. Sunset flip onto the ladder and bounces off the ladder. Oh, my. Bro, I just. At number four, we have perhaps one of the greatest performers in the I said this, Sheldon, Sheldon Benjamin, Benjamin, bro. Now, this is not for any one moment, but for his collection of moments over the years. Dude is consistently been fantastic. From his leap at WrestleMania 22. Look at this. To his dive at WrestleMania 25, Shelton was incredible in the ladder match mm -hmm. and was always must-see. He's the one person I felt like never really wanted, but he always showed out in every single match he was in. 
at number three, we have the leg drop. Many superstars have used the variation of the leg drop from the ladder, none mm -hmm. more so than the Hardy Boys. They would consistently innovate up until perhaps the most famous spot where Jeff Hardy leaped on edge at WrestleMania 23. That was brutal. I watched no, it that live. the Hardys who would use Ooh. their legs from the ladder as Kofi Kingston had his own ladder match moment, executing a boom drop on Drew McIntyre from the ladder at Money in the Bank 2010. Ooh. Number two, we have various wrestlers execute their finishes from the ladder. We've seen the Bubba Bomb, the Umprettia, the Education, the T-Bone Suplex, mm -hmm. the Bookend, the Backstabber, mm -hmm. the Zigzag, the Big Ending, and more. But none were more special than when Kalisto... This was a very good win oh my god this was so good it is salida del so from the top of the ladder oh, tlc this was sick bro look at this oh, i don't care what nobody say that's one of the sickest moves through a ladder that is so sick oh my god that was the crowd went crazy that bro that was sick we gotta run that back the Salida del Sol from the top of the ladder. And I was just saying uh, in my thoughts uh, and opinions video for uh, Money in the Bank, I think if they're going to set up a rematch between the Usos and the Street Profits, it needs to be in a TLC match at SummerSlam. TLC match at SummerSlam. Book it, please. Since I, I don't think they have the pay-per-view Lined up for this year. I think they're going to go away from using the TLC pay-per-view. This needs to happen. SummerSlam. TLC match for the unified tag team titles. End it there. Oh, my gosh. A number one spot goes to perhaps the most infamous yep. ladder match spot in history. The spear. Now, we've seen plenty of spears hit from the ladder, but none were as special as the spear by Edge yep. on Jeff Hardy at WrestleMania 17. Yep. The amount of times we've seen that replayed in our lifetimes goes to show how special it was. It, yep. Oh, my God. As always, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to give it a like and subscribe. And they said in lead up to that match, that wouldn't like they talked about it, but they never actually did it. It was literally, hey, I'm, gonna, I'm probably going to do this spot, so this is what we're going to do. But they never, I don't think they actually practiced it. It was just, this is what we're going to do, and we're going to wing it. So the announcers were just completely surprised and shocked as well as everybody else. That's the channel. And comment below your favorite ladder match spot. Also, if you like this video, be sure to check out our video on facts you might not have known about money in the bank. Hope you have. Hey, man. Y'all go show wrestling flashback some love right now go subscribe to him check out his content um i believe he has a patreon go check out his patreon i think he'd be posting more videos on there so go check him out man uh show him some love this was a dope cool video brought back many 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 uh memories man many la uh, ladder map mi uh, latter match memories it, it's, it's just crazy how these guys are willing to put their body on the line for these in these type of matches for our entertainment so i always show respect and love to the wrestlers that are willing to do that even the women you know so but comment down below let me know what's your favorite ladder match of all time let me know down below i want to get your uh favorite ladder match of all time but i appreciate all the love and support road to actually whoa, whoa, whoa. before i end the video i don't want to just say ladder match I want to put it all in to context. What's your favorite TLC match? Because a lot of these matches had tables and stuff involved in them too. So what's your favorite TLC match or favorite ladder match? Let me know down below. There we are. Now I can end the video. But I appreciate y'all kicking with me. See y'all next one. Peace.